What I admire about Tesla is their effect on the industry. Before Tesla, there were electric cars, but Tesla has encouraged others to build electric cars that appear nicer. Tesla is also indirectly referenced to other things. For instance, Proterra isn't part of Tesla, but the catalyst has been called the Tesla of buses. Proterra has also influenced the industry. Many have since acquired Proterra buses, and other manufacturers have partnered with Proterra to use their technology on their prospective vehicles. So what about the rail industry? How come we don't see that many battery electric locomotives? Well, it mostly depends on pricing and demand. With pricing, a diesel locomotive could cost around $2 million, whereas an electric bus could be almost half that price. Also, as far as demand, if I were a manufacturer, I would rather an overwhelming demand than an overwhelming supply. Although Amtrak, Union Pacific, and other railroads award contracts with a manufacturer, that is rare for the rail industry because the equipment may last 20 or more years, whereas buses may have a shorter lifespan. So I don't see Tesla, Proterra, BYD, or some other company directly building locomotives. Instead, I could see companies like these partnering with well-known manufacturers like Bombardier, Brookville, General Electric, or EMD to have an existing or future product line modify with charging batteries and a powerful electric motor for freight or passenger service. In the case with General Electric, I loved the Dash and Evolution series way before starting my channel. Now, even though GE discontinued the Evolution Hybrid program, they have some partial experience with electric locomotives. So if Proterra, BYD, or someone else partners with them, we could see the first battery electric locomotive. Who do you think should manufacture them? Tell me in the comments and remember to like, share, and subscribe. Also, follow me on social media where I talk about similar topics.